Today, we're taking a look at rocket launches, but not the ones you know about. Today, we're not focused on screwing up. No, we're talking about the biggest mistakes in space exploration history. Rocket launches don't always go off without a hitch as they go from catastrophic explosions to small malfunctions with massive consequences. Space travel is extremely difficult, we all know that. It's precise, it's cutting edge technology, and it takes years to get it ready. But mistakes happen and big ones happen. Well, let's see at some of the most shocking rocket launch failures we have seen so far. The Challenger disaster, 1986, a national tragedy. We have to start with one of the most infamous and heartbreaking moments in space exploration, the Challenger disaster. On January 28, 1986, at Cape Canaveral, Florida, seven astronauts boarded the space shuttle Challenger, which had lifted off. Unfortunately, the shuttle broke apart only 73 seconds into the flight and the crew lost all 12 crew members. The cause? A failure of an O-ring seal in one of the rocket boosters that allowed hot gas to escape and ignite the shuttle's external fuel tank. The Challenger disaster was a huge shock to the world and a major reevaluation of what NASA thought it could do. Lest we forget, space exploration is a dangerous business. The N-1 rocket failures, 1969-1972, the Soviet Union struggles. The N-1 rocket from the Soviet Union, of course, was a rocket that was supposed to send a Soviet cosmonaut to the moon. Unlike NASA's Saturn V rocket, the N-1 was Soviet's answer to the manned spaceflight rocket and turned out to be one of the most expensive and unsuccessful rocket programs in history. The Soviets launched the N-1 four times between 1969 and 1972, all four times failing. On July 3rd, 1969, one of the largest non-nuclear explosions in history happened when the rocket exploded just seconds after liftoff. One day, the Soviets finally called it quits on the N-1 program, shelving their dream of beating the United States to the moon. Ariane 5 Flight 501, 1996. A software glitch cost $370 million, the Ariane 5 rocket made its maiden flight on its test flight from French Guiana on June 4, 1996. After 37 seconds, the rocket veered off course and detonated in a self-destruction and splat, along with a $370 million payload. The cause of this failure? A software error. When the rocket's inertial reference system tried to turn that large data value into a smaller one, it was more data than the small space could contain. The catastrophic failure was caused by this software bug, which enabled the rocket to miscalculate its trajectory. This early mistake was to be one of the most costly in space history. But thankfully, the Ariane 5 program developed a pace. SpaceX Falcon 1, learning from failure. We all remember that SpaceX was once a pioneer in space technology and they certainly had their fair share of failures. We are talking about the Falcon 1 rocket, for example. Of the first three Falcon 1 launches between 2006 and 2008, all of them ended in failure. It was a fuel leak that caused the engine to fail, and that was the first failure. Two failed following vibration problems in the second rocket, and one when two stages of the rocket collided after separation. SpaceX didn't make its first successful launch until its fourth launch in 2008. These were a major setback, but SpaceX learned from them and later went on to make leaps and bounds with the Falcon 9 and Falcon Heavy. Proton-M rocket failure, 2013, the epic crash. On July 2nd, 2013, Russia's Proton-M rocket blasted off from the Baikonur Cosmodrome, but just seconds later, it went very badly. It then tilted wildly, and 17 seconds later, the rocket slammed back down to Earth in a huge explosion. The cause of the crash? Angular velocity sensors flipped upside down. This small but crucial mistake led to the rocket completely losing control. And while three GLONASS satellites were worth over $200 million, the crash destroyed them. The failure shocked the space community and pointed to the need in rocket assembly to pay close attention to detail. Mars Climate Orbiter 1999 metric versus imperial mix-up. This isn't exactly a rocket failure, but the mistake is so huge that we just have to include it. NASA sent the Mars Climate Orbiter up into space in 1999 to investigate the Martian atmosphere. The spacecraft made it up to Mars after traveling millions of miles before disintegrating upon entering Mars' atmosphere. The cause? It is simply a unit conversion error. 
One team was measuring in metric units, the other in imperial units pounds instead of newtons. The spacecraft entered Mars's atmosphere at the wrong angle. Something as small as this mistake could cause that spacecraft to be destroyed. The lesson is that even in space travel, such a small error as could be made on the moon was very costly indeed. Antares rocket explosion, 2014, a dramatic failure. Antares was to be an Orbital Sciences Corporation rocket to deliver cargo to the International Space Station in October 2014. The rocket exploded in a fiery spectacle live six seconds after liftoff. One of the engines used a defective turbo pump, a part obtained from old Soviet rocket parts. The rocket and its payload of supplies for the astronauts bound for the ISS was destroyed in the blast. But the setback was also a wake-up call for NASA's commercial space program, and Orbital Sciences was okay the following couple of years when it returned to the skies under a resurgent commercial space banner.